Uh, lions are individually wonderful and great. There is no match to an Indian lion. I, I do not hesitate. The kind of time we put in, the amount of effort that we put in, the amount of service that each one of you carry. But as a team, sometimes, you know, we are not seen a great collective team. Somehow, this has been a number of areas. I'm not sounding negative, but then we try to score ourselves to be an individual player and outsmart the rest. But remember, when we have a common good, common goal, collective goal, I think it's it's the collective team effort, collective victory, the collective success is the largest and the biggest success. I think that is what this organization as a club member at the club level teaches us. As a district cabinet member, being part of a district cabinet of a governor teaches us to be how effectively we are and beyond district, wherever we are and whatever the assignment. Well, you know, this is what the globally line leaders do assess all of us, who we are and what we are. But on a personal count, I would like to also share something. Well, in a very successful Western world or anywhere in the world, uh, speaking negative of somebody, speaking uh, negatives of a job done by others is not really seen on a very bright side of that individual. Well, it's, it's important that if we are a team, we are one. Well, we are a team that sounds that we are going to work collectively, collaboratively in order to achieve what we want to achieve. I, I still remember we are all part of doing all kind of, I don't call it politics, but all gimmicks in order to be a successful person in the next rung of the ladder. Each one wanted to climb quickly and possible jump a couple of rungs and go faster. It's important. It is not that you go there up. You must take your friend along with you. I think this is what uh, Nagaraju and I enjoy thoroughly in our friendship. He's been just not a mentor to all of you. He's truly a friend and a great mentor to me too. Kind of work that he does in the training area, the kind of work that he does in the teaching fraternity, especially the English communicating skills. You are so lucky that he's part of your multiple. We are lucky he's part of the Lions of India. That's what I, I, I would put it this way. Thank you once again, um, Nagaraj Garu, for all the good efforts that you put in in developing our fellow Lions. Please continue to do. I wish you all the very best. Yes, you are right. I did take a little time. Uh, today, we had a director's and other meeting with the Vice President A.P. Singh about the Give Conclave. And I don't want to digress with that information. So I just took a break. And he had seen... You're going to be late. You have a meeting to do it. That's the kind of understanding that each one has. Once again, I wish you all the very, very best and deeply honored with this wonderful gesture of, you know, you know, inaugurating this. Good luck to you. Good luck to the team who's attending. And a great luck to my friend, Lain Amarnath, who's going to do a wonderful job. And I have no doubt about it. Good luck to you. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you, Secretary Vijayji. Thank you very much for those opening remarks. I think you have already set the tone for the presentation by making those initial comments, and which are very, very appropriate for the occasion. I think you've already done a lot of research on that subject, it seems. <laughs> so that, that's really good. Uh, I know you always come very well prepared for any presentation, and then this proves the kind of work that you've already done on that. Uh, when I actually assigned this subject to Amarnath, I thought uh, it was some kind of a challenge. Uh, this was a new area on which perhaps not much material was available. In fact, I warned Amar that he was accepting a challenge and he was ready to jump in and he was ready to do something uh, new. And that's why he said that he would like to take it up. Luckily, uh, our uh, distinguished guest Vijay Kumar Raju has begun um, uh, and then by he set the tone for this presentation by making some uh, relevant remarks on the topic. Uh, now it's over to our vice district governor, 320D, one of my very, 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 very good friends from my home district, Lyme 
Amarnath Rao to begin the presentation. Thank you. Thank you, Nagara, sir. Thank you very much. Let us begin. Uh, let us begin this uh, uh, presentation by a poll. I'm launching this poll. I request everyone to participate in the poll. Which, which do you think is better, collaborative intelligence or independent intelligence? Now the poll starts in, you can answer them. Sir, is it uh, visible that collaborative? 94% says like wow, collaborative intelligence is better oh. and 6% uh, says independent uh, intelligence. Great, great. Wonderful, wonderful. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Praveen, for sharing that. Uh, that's great. And let's go for the... Uh, one more poll. 73% uh, people have said that all the above. 73% well, of the all the above. Thank you. Thank you very much. That uh, really creates more service opportunity, increases growth opportunity, produces capable, capable leaders, strengthens organizations. These are all helpful for the uh, alliance uh, for the collaborative intelligence. Thank you very much. Thanks a lot. Uh, today, we are going to, in this session, I'm going to share about the uh, some my thoughts and videos about the uh, collaborative intelligence. Let me share my... Yes, please go ahead. Collaborative intelligence, as our chief guest Vijay Kumar Raj has uh, explained briefly about the collaborative intelligence, how we collectively to help us uh, in, uh, help us in the journey of success. I request everyone to share your ideas and thoughts on collaborative intelligence in thought uh, in chat box your ideas and thoughts on collaborative intelligence i think i already read this asha has written that collaborative intelligence refers to the combined efforts of humans and artificial intelligence working together to solve problems to achieve goals, that's one uh, detailed definition. Okay. And Sandeep Kasadam has said he would like to learn new and smart ways of learning and doing tasks. And, uh, Thank you so much for your wonderful uh, responses about the collaborative intelligence. As a leader, we know that collaboration is key to success. While there are many different skills involved in collaborative, collaborative leadership, Collaborative intelligence is one of the most important among them. According to a research recently uh, done, people spend 50% more time collaborating today than they did a decade ago. Than a decade ago. In the, world, in the early stages, in the olden days, when it was a chain, but the, the works assigned, the works done will be the individual. Gradually, it is going to shift a group of uh, groups and uh, teams working together for a common goal, as uh, Vijay Kumar Raju has uh, rightly said. Uh, we know that uh, in, in India, in the in Indian subcontinent, how familiar the cricket team is. The cricket team is how familiar it is played by 11 players uh, collaboratively working to playing together for a, for a success, for to win the game. Here, the 11 players had to collaboratively uh, play for a, for, a, for a win because there is a, there will be the, the bowlers has to do excel in bowling, the batters has to do the excel in batting and the keeper has to do the excel in keeping and all the fielder, all the players had to do the fielding excel. Apart from this, they, they collectively had to take a, the right decision, effective decision at the right time. That will help the help the team to win. That the help them leads to the success. Talent wins games, but teamwork and intelligence win the championships. Friends, this is this is uh, what about um, uh, integrity of the collaborative intelligence? I had gone through the web and uh, found out three uh, related and find better uh, definitions for the collaborative intelligence. I invite. Uh, uh, Na Narsimha Raju to go through the
Razu, please yes. read out the definition. Collaborative intelligence is a systematic approach that connects teams to unlock their genius, taking insights and ideas from possibility to reality. Really, collaborative intelligence unlock the genius. It will be we, when we can, when the group of people come together, they had to contribute the best. They had to share their video ideas. They had shared their video insights and ideas to 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 make the uh, possibility to a real one. As we know that uh, for in 2018, a campaign 300 has been launched by our international to raise the funds uh, to LCIF. The target was 300 millions. Then we thought that it is the biggest target for us. But we collectively made it possible and we are surprised it and made the 334 millions of uh, donations. That's what uh, collaborate has a uh, done with collaborative intelligence. This is the second definition. Razu, please go to that. Collaborative intelligence is the ability to understand and utilize the unique strengths of each individual on your team synergistically to accomplish a shared goal more effectively. This is one uh, already by Vijay Kumar Razu has uh, uh, mentioned and shared that individuals Whatever they be individuals, maybe individuals, how much excel they perform, but when come together, they perform more, they give a more outcome, and they, they will reach the shared goal more effectively and uh, more energetically, very fast. And a single uh, statement uh, color me, uh, definition is here. Razu, please. Heterogeneous networks of people interacting to produce intelligent outcomes. Different perceptives of people when come together and uh, work for a and work for a common goal, definitely it will be a, it will give a more productivity, more efficiency, and more with more efficiency we'll get a more productivity. That is what collaborative intelligence definitions I feel uh, uh, very related and appropriate. This uh, thank you, Razu. Thank you very much. As a, in uh, when in, in our childhood in our childhood days we have in our childhood there were many many motivating and inspiring stories shared by our uh, shared by our uh, grandparents and teachers one among them is panchatantra stories that a unity of birds are let's fry that has very inspiring i still remember my days do you remember this story yes uh, jyoti to uh, share their yeah. story with us Yes. A flock of birds was flying in the sky. Suddenly, one of the birds spotted and saw some grains on the ground. Grains? Plenty of grains here, said the bird. Let's land here. I'm so hungry and tired, said another bird. But the leader of the bird tried to stop them. We should not act in haste. This may be a trap to catch us. I see no danger, said a young bird. Yes, I too agree. Those grains look so delicious and tasty, said another bird. Hiding in a bush was a hunter with a net. I hope the silly birds will come down, he thought. As soon as the birds landed on the ground, he threw his net over them. The birds were panicked and they were shouting and some tried to fly right and some fly to left. But there was no route to escape from the net. Oh no, cried some birds. And one of the birds said, Oh leader, we should have listened to your wise words. And they requested him how to make a move. Then the leader was silent. And he said, that bird said, still we can escape. Stop flying in all directions. All of you should fly only in one direction. By saying this, it pointed to fly in to the 
to the right. Now it gave the caution. One, two, three. That's it. As the ordered by their leader, the birds took off all the all together and they took that net with them. The hunter watched them fly in the sky and he said, I lost not only my catch but my net as well. The birds landed safely near a pond where they had friends the mice and all requested the mice and the mice had bitten all that their net and birds got freedom and they flew away happily in the sky. Thank you, Jyoti. Thank you very much. That was a nice presentation. Thank you very much. Friends, what do you learn about from, from this story? You can type your answers in the chat box. Oh, it's appreciation getting. <laughs> okay. It reveals the importance of collaborative intelligence. It helps the teams to do their best and boost. Friends, our torchbearer to the Lions Clubs has rightly said, alone we can do so little. Together we can do so much. How great it is. How great two lines of message it is. Uh, rep representing the collaborative intelligence. Another one, if everyone is moving forward, forward together, then success takes care of itself. When we collectively, collaboratively work together, definitely the success will come to us, success will come to us. Friends, it is, it is collaborative intelligence that make the groups work together and that strive for the success. That is the Collaborative intelligence makes a, a vital role in the, in the journey of success. As we know, collaborative intelligence, we know that we, we had shared that that is that there plays a major role in the uh, journey of success. There may be a lot of advantages of, with collaborative intelligence. I request the friends, friends you all to share your thoughts of advantages, what you, what you think of the advantages of collaborative intelligence. Please share, type your answers in the chat box. Unity is strength, okay? Together we can, together we can, we can win. Thank you much uh, for your wonderful responses, new ideas, connected knowledge, more ideas to work together, wonderful ideas, thumbs up, Okay, unity is with a teamwork, join, win, win. Wow, oh, excellent answer. Thank you so much for your uh, responses. Unity is strength. Excellent, sir. Thank you. Success is the best when it is collaborative. Success is the best when it is collaborative. Friends, I will share some of the advantages from the collaborative intelligence. It increases efficiency and productivity. Friends, coming together, working together, and uh, sharing of ideas, and contributing the, our talent, and contributing our treasure, time, definitely increases the efficiency and also increases the productivity. We all know that Lions Clubs in, is the basic, is the um, base is a club. It is an association of Lions Clubs. We, when we go for the extension of a club, the extension of alliance clubs, the GET coordinator, the global extension team will take care and promote and help us in extending a club. The international has a uh, vision uh, to advance, to make it collaborative roles or to play the collaboratives by the GATT and uh, make it efficient and result, uh, get the growth productivity. And GATT has been in the, uh, involved in the in the strategically involved for the uh, achievement, for the growth of the, for the strength of the organization. Uh, when uh, global extension team has taken care of the extension, 
and when the club is formed there is a sufficient effective leadership is required for the uh, club the club leadership is the glt the glt team the global leadership team came well to enhance the uh, leadership skills among among them uh, clubs among the leader lines and so that uh, they can strengthen uh, the clubs and the meanwhile they to have have the leadership long run g the membership growth is required and retaining of the membership is very important that will be taken and by the global membership team to, to retain the membership to get the satisfaction in the membership in the lineism uh, there more services has to perform so that they can be satisfied they can really relay longer where the global service team have will take care of that the like that the gat glt gmt gst gt will all together work for the uh, for a cause of uh, strengthening the organization recently recently the our leadership international leadership had found and launched a uh, campaign inspiring with the campaign 100 program they launched the campaign 1.5 mission 1.5 it is a dream of for four decades to uh, to increase the membership to a 1.5 million we we at, at least in the uh, in the period of four years this 1.5 through the 1. Point mission 1.5 we have to strengthen our uh, organization in all respects and reach the uh, reach the goal of 1.5 by this we had uh, sit together international leadership at street together apart from this these uh, glt gmt gst all together has to work and uh, uh, for the strengthening and good uh, success and uh, apart from this they had a brainstorming and they also uh, suggested that some more gat uh, collaborative roles have to work for the uh, this success apart from this is uh, marketing uh, leo lcf fwc these also are joining with a uh, joining hands with uh, and uh, generating the new ideas friends as you know that when two when a group of people took together they share their ideas thoughts then automatically their new ideas will be generated last year i was the glt coordinator of our district 320d we under the able guidance of nagarasa we together and we want we had a brainstorming and discussed and share our ideas to have a good program so that the members in the club retain a long they contribute a long that they, they work for the strength the collectively work for the strength and apart from this uh, but this brainstorming we had a great idea of club lions leadership institute clli it was the first of its in the kind in the entire world this had helped a lot from uh, in generated the idea new ideas are generated from this so collaborative intelligence generates new ideas and uh, from builds trust and uh, communication these eight uh, when we take the gat team as example these eight uh teams who work together for a good cause of uh, one per mission to reach the 1.5 mission what each each is one uh, interrelated and uh, one of the one among them build a trust and uh, they work collectively for the for a good cause for the success of the for strengthen of this organization and also when they work uh, work together they come together when they generate ideas automatically they they enhance the communication among them a good communication has to be take place the international leadership has took for taking thing into the past experiences they had a, a group of discussion and had a good uh, and had a, a very emerging and a encouraging awards also that to communicate it is a, a these group of leaders has to be uh, communicate to the base to get that honor uh, Uh, friends when is all this uh, uh, as when you take the example of the uh, gat gat team this all together uh, generate uh, contribute their ideas glt team will contribute the uh, ideas of global leadership gst contribute the promotion of the service activities gmt will contribute the idea of uh, uh, talent membership growth and uh, lcf will contribute the strengthening of the lcs and contribution uh, contrib uh, Uh, collecting the donations for the lcf fwc will work for the family and women membership growth marketing will then uh, we work for the strengthening and market the uh, uh, greatness of the organization so that every can can share their ideas their ideas are put together uh, for the strengthening of our organization 
when a group of people come together and share their ideas and create uh, uh, share their ideas then everyone feels that they and the uh, the strengthening the success is because of uh, is a because of one of their uh, contribution their sharing of ideas and they are part of that success this fosters a sense of ownership friends and uh, and also working together all the eight together um, uh, together working together and make for a a good decision making as earlier stated last year when was uh, when we all together sit and uh, uh, for the strengthening and retaining of membership and for the good leadership we had a cllli uh, it helps in the decision making and helps in decision and promoting the members when we had organizing a lca program to the new clubs last year we had organized nine lca cll sorry nine cllis to the nine clubs when we are organizing a nine cllis you may may not believe that friends uh, when the new we had organized cll for the new members new uh, new members newly joined the line uh, members into the organization they here we had kept the lcf as one of the topic in that uh, cllf when listening to the lcf the new members uh, voluntarily come out and gave an uh, gave a contribution of mjf you believe it or not from nine lcas we have collected 12 mgfs voluntarily only by listening to that and by motive self motivating from that but uh, that this made me, uh, made us to uh, strengthen and uh, making a faster decision making and uh, expand the cllli and this year already we had conducted more to more uh, improves problem solving friends when when these all gat teams collaboratively work together collaboratively work together for strengthening and uh, definitely it, it improves the problem solving whatever the arises and definitely it improves the problem solving these are the advantages of the uh, collaborative intelligence that definitely strive for the success uh, structures and that will help to strengthen the organization or institution or the school or industry or the any team and that will be advantages these all uh, these all will help the uh, collaborative intelligence friends apart from the uh, advantages where there are advantages there will be, be, be some challenges to we have to overcome the th th uh, challenges to get the success can you please share what challenges what challenges we can face in the collaborative intelligence what challenges can we please type your answer in the uh, chat box the communication right artificial intelligence ananas difference of opinions very good cooperation wonderful thank you for what my your wonderful responses friends here i will share some of the uh, challenges that in poor communication this is the major barrier major challenge which is that poor communication will uh, will be, will be a barrier for the collaborative intelligence for the success we all know that uh, to encourage uh, never before the international has uh, uh, announced a lot of uh, medals and awards and uh, for the uh, membership growth and extension but uh, this is not advan uh, awarded and encouraged and announced that how are responsible the get the responsible to the gap team is to, to take it to the, the base level to the club level to the members so that they can uh, get a uh, inspiring they get Uh, motivated and uh, poor uh, communication definitely if we, if we not do that the, the purpose of the challenge or the mission 1.5 challenge we can't meet it uh, meet it so it is a poor communication friends when come to the poor com communication in my hand in my mind that oh, uh, one of the uh, bitter experience uh, i got into my mind uh, i when i am teaching to your children i may i ask them to do a experiment so that uh, they know how liquor is harmful to the health i asked the students to take two uh, beakers transparent beakers on the table and uh, i requested them to take wa distilled water pure bisleri water in one uh, one of that and uh, uh, some alcohol concentrate or alcohol in a, another beaker and uh, some of the concentrate alcohol on in the in that beaker some when i i given two insects to drop in the two beakers 
the students take took the uh, inset two inserted one in the uh, water bisleri water and another in the uh, dropped in the alcohol after some times you have know that uh, the insect in the um, alcohol had died i th i thought I had explained uh, very well how the how the harmful is the liquor i asked the student how what you learn from this experiment when i was um, i'm hearing to the uh, answer of the student i was really surprised and shocked the, do you do know the what the uh, what the student had given the answer the student gave the, the student told that sir after after taking the alcohol all the germs and insects will die in my in stomach that what he had told that so i went and, uh, and the next moment i realized how is the my perceptive wrong or the students perceptive wrong to my knowledge to my i have given the uh, conveyed by good message and in his in his angle is perceptive as correct but i thought i i realized that i had not uh, the transition of message is not correct what i intended has not as failed fail, i had failed to incorporate to the student this is the uh, poor communication will also may lead to the misunderstanding gaps and uh, less productivity this will non cooperation as you know the most of the as you know the most of the most of the students uh, most of the clubs are uh, in most of the clubs two three two to three members are working for the uh, betterment of the club in very few clubs all the club all the members collaboratively collectively work with there in a recent uh, recent survey uh, survey it has been uh, decided that 35% of high valuation collaboration within organization 35% high value collaboration within organizations comes from only 3 to 5% of members only 3 to 5 members are uh, are proving that high performance and doing the major collaborative work this in this uh, if you think that if more members will come to, uh, come together and work that will how great it will be in our district there is a club lions club of hyderabad jubli hills more than 50 members are there in a in a club but when i joined in lionism in 2002 since 2002 to till date all the club members collectively work they contribute in all aspects every member contribute their time talent and treasure since 20 years in the two decades their club is standing in the first position in the district at the awards night so if every body every member will uh, contribute for the co and cooperate definitely it will be a uh, success and collaborative uh, intelligence will be achieved achieved the success friends lack of coordination we also observed the lack of coordination lot of things a uh, lot of uh, clubs and uh, if we if we take the examples of gat if all together eight members all together work for the uh, work together and collectively share their ideas and contribute their talent definitely in the, in the one reaching of uh, achieving 1.4 uh, mission 1.4 not uh, impossible it will definitely a possible but if it uh, if it do not coordinate with the clubs in the districts and the among the lines it will be a big big challenge to us conflict of opinions friends albert in uh, earlier in the starting we had a uh, story of a bird, uni unity of birds uh, when the birds are flying in the uh, flying in the sky the birds have a conflict of opinions that may they take to a danger position danger situation after the, uh, coming to uh, coming to under to the net also they had a different conflict of opinions some birds are going for left some are birds are for flying to light and come out going for this uh, conflict of opinion definitely will be a challenge for the collaborative intelligence collaborative work uh, and uh, for the success friends diversity diversity tuning uh, tuning diversity to india uh, strength to a strength definitely it will be a, a success it leads to a great success but when diversity uh, diverse of opinions diverse of knowledge uh, is also a challenge for the uh, success of the success of the organization disconnection this is the i think disconnection is the major thing um, uh, prevents teams from coming together in a productive way it is a major challenge for the major barrier for the uh, uh, collaborative intelligence people when they are not connected 
they can't uh, they we can uh, they they can't work for the better productivity as we know most of the in uh, i strongly believe the success of a club or a president depends upon the conducting of meetings regularly if you conduct the meetings regularly the club will perform the district will perform better if you conduct the meetings regularly the men there will be a good connection they are connected well connected the members will be well connected uh, well connected and uh, inefficient meetings are really a bad punch that will definitely disconnection is the biggest challenge and uh, from 2020 uh, from the corona period the technology has been playing a major role today we all coming together uh, due to this technology from different parts of the world different countries we are coming here and participating in this event this but uh, even technology has also facing some hurdles the recently software companies have conducted a survey according to them 60% of the people disconnected from their colleagues because of remote work the challenges we face from the technology hurdles are limitations in connectivity compatibility issues inadequate tools incomplete knowledge on technical tools it becomes harder for people to work together effectively friends these are the challenges we got uh, with them so uh, as the time is going on we'll go for the some of the i will share some of the best practices that will help us for the collective coll collaborative intelligence friends uh, some of that i will tell uh, work together working together will definitely leads, leads to the collaborative intelligence and the success stay can always stay connected that help the collaboratively work, working together for the success trust each other a brainstorm a, bra a good way brainstorm has to be done uh, brainstorming a, is a great way to generate new ideas and solve problems uh, solve problems Uh, communicate if already uh, earlier discussed uh, communication plays a uh, vital role in the success be flexible give the freedom to the members uh, to the members that to your team so that they can speak uh, freely they can express their ideas opinions they share ideas they contribute and they can take the risk in taking the risk also uh, be uh, be uh, uh, flexible and the delegating of work is also one of the best practices when i delegate the work to the data the individual feel that that the importance has given to me and it, it takes its ownership and contribute for the contribute to the, the success uh, teams beginning begin by building trust accept diversity already, uh, already we, uh, we told that uh, people work together by tuning diversity to strength that will be in a positive mode if you work to take it as a diversity in a positive mode that will be it become a uh, strength mutual understanding is very important among the group members or teams for the collective uh, collaborative intelligence we have to build a bonds maintain the good relations among things that's why we have we are organizing uh, for the gat uh, success of gat team we are organizing a gat conclave last week only we organized a gat conclave and all india isami level gat conclave we are hosting in hyderabad in october 8th 9th definitely it will be uh, across the uh, isami uh, discussion we have to provide the way we have to give the possibility of discuss uh, discuss by the among the members so that we can uh, a good ideas will be generated and new ideas will be generated and they can contribute a lot there uh, for the success review for this every uh, whether it be a success or failure we have to review we have to get the feedback we have to feed, uh, get uh, feedback how many how fast we can get the solutions but we have to get, get review of the uh, strategies so that uh, we can perform more uh, able in the future the siba these are the some best practice which help of in friends uh, nowadays tools and uh, platforms are also social media and artificial intelligence also making a big role in the collaborative intelligence it is a very key factor in collaborative i now invite uh, um, my brother uh, pravin to come Mm, explain the importance of social media and artificial how they to help with the collaborative intelligence pravin yep thank you very much anna like um, collaborative intelligence when it comes to social media okay it is a key role in collaborative intelligence you know like our regular whatsapp groups how much it will help us to gain some insights and inputs from our team members when you share a thought or a question in that group they all will give some uh, you know nice ideas and uh, inputs which will lead to a uh, very good uh, final conclusion which can be used in your uh, whatever the question you have 
like how many of you know global lions forum facebook page uh, maybe many of you know uh, regularly you might be watching that uh, facebook page and uh, global lions forum wherein every day somewhere from the corner of the world some lion is sending a message are asking a question and there are many many other people across the world is giving some nice answers and then we are coming to a conclusion what to do and how to do and all so that's how the social media also plays a major role in uh, collaborative intelligence and coming to artificial intelligence yes this also can play a wonders in when you are especially like we were discussing about uh, our meetings you know when you are conducting a meeting invite the artificial intelligence there are many tools available in the market like uh, author or uh, fireflies and assembly okay uh, phantom phantom is my uh, phantom is my favorite one because it's free of cost you can just use that tool in your um, regular meetings just invite uh, them invite that tool into your meeting which can record your complete meeting and take out all the inputs whatever you are discussing and all and in in the fingertips like you know end of the meeting if you want to find out like what was the key topics that was discussed in the meeting it will give you that and what are the action items that you have discussed and what are the follow ups that you need to do it will give all the information not only that it captures the meeting recordings also the entire uh, recording will be taken and if you want to see some videos bits and pieces of the important items announced by different people it can give you those uh, you know videos and not only that like even during the meeting in between if you want to have a recap of that meeting it can be done so these kind of uh, you know artificial uh, things can help you uh, to have a better collaborative uh, intelligence um, i mean it, it will help you i i would tell you one thing like even if you are alone in an island or somewhere you still can collaborate with many people if you have a small tools and techniques in your hands you can collaborate and you can do a much more than it's not like if you have the technology with you by using this artificial intelligence and the social media tools okay you are not alone you are you are alone there with thousand minds and uh, come to a conclusion and create a wonders with that and that's how we can use social media and artificial intelligence for the collaborative intelligence thank you thank you parvin that was wonder really it is making collaborative uh, artificial intelligence you play a major role in a, uh, in collaborative intelligence promoting the collaborative intelligence friends uh, as the topics is collaborative intelligence i uh, made to you know i involve my friends to collaborate in this presentation so due to the time constant i am the getting the to the last uh, great discoveries and improvements invariably involve the collaboration of many minds as you know unity is strength when there is teamwork and collaboration wonderful things can be achieved competition makes faster collaboration makes us better friends by by one minute by harnessing the power of collaborative intelligence you can take your time to new levels of success i wish you all the best thank you so much thanks a lot Oh, yeah. thank thank you thank you very much amar i think uh, that has been a product of collaborative intelligence because i know during the last few days amar has been uh, discussing this topic with a few other friends of his and all of them have put their ideas together so collaborative intelligence has has been established is putting our minds together uh, i mean thinking together and evolving together more than the physical collaboration which of course is well known to all uh, if you raise your virtual hands i'll invite questions from you we have time for only some two or three questions in case anybody wishes to ask a question please raise your virtual hand you need to go to the reactions button at the bottom and if you press if you click reactions you will find or maybe there is a, some some versions may have raise hand directly 
Anai, that's an applause. Vijayalakshmi, I don't know if you want to ask a question or is that an applause? Uh, Chakradar, do you have a question? I'm unmuting you. Chakradar, you can ask your question. Uh, no, no, I was just checking the raising button. I okay, right, right, right. Okay, no problem. Does anybody have a question? Uh, there were quite a few questions, but I don't know if I can go back to them. Len Marwa wanted to ask some questions. Len Marwa, are you there? Do you mind unmuting yourself or maybe raising your hand so that I can see you and unmute you? Uh, yeah, Len Muni Ratnam Garu, do you have a question? Yeah, I've unmuted you. Please switch on your microphone and speak. Muni Ratnam. Yes, sir. Hello. Go ahead. Am I audible? Yes, sir. Yeah, um, yeah, good evening, sir. Good evening to everybody. So it's a wonderful, um, refreshing session. And I think, you no, know, you know, um, uh, Amarnath Garu is, um, is saying um, yeah, in the entire lot, about 3 to 4 percent of uh, people are uh, collaborating, working collaboratively and uh, uh, getting the results of this thing. You know, how do you think that, you no, know, it is uh, very essential in uh, uh, Lions Arena nowadays? As you know, sir, we, uh, most of the clubs in the we, we will see the data from that. Most of the clubs uh, getting into financial suspension every year. Uh, when we go, uh, when the year end is engaged, uh, year end in the year end June, most of the clubs are. Uh, uh, in 2008, our uh, membership in the district in the lines is to eight thousand seven thousand seventy uh, one uh, seventy five thousand around that. Uh, 7,500 uh, 7, around clubs are there. But when it comes to the uh, these days, it is getting down every year. We have getting down. Um, uh, at the starting of year, we are getting more clubs. But at the end of the day, we are going, the, the clubs are going away. And when we come to that, when we ask if there are 100 clubs are there, very few 20 to 25 percent are doing extraordinary and 20 to 25 percent and 30 to 40 persons need the support from them uh, to strengthen it, the, uh, that club. Uh, according to that, we had a re research from the dot I had collected from that. Thank you. Uh, thank you. I think uh, I think we must make some kind of a distinction between physical collaboration, which is getting work done and intellectual collaboration, which we are talking about today, collaborative intelligence. So it's not just working together, it's thinking together, putting our minds together. So lionism has plenty of examples. There are countless examples. Uh, Amar has already pointed out how the GAT team works, the eight of us in every district, at every club level, at the multiple level, putting our hearts and minds and uh, together and then uh, thinking creatively. Uh, Surya Prakash, do you have a question? You can unmute yourself. Plan Surya Prakash? Yeah, very good evening, sir. Good evening. Uh, the, really, it was a really good section on the question, collaboration part. What I feel that the immediate PST or the ZC should give the 100% support to the newcomers and they have to give them more collaborative ideas so that they, that will become an easy and motivation to the new PST, where we can uh, stop the depression, I mean, what we call the reduction of the members here. Simultaneously, we have to involve the new members in each and every activity. This is what I I feel, that we need the collaborative support from the immediate PSTs and the immediate ZC. Okay, thank you very much for that comment. That's a good idea. Any other question? Okay, thank you, everybody. Thank you very much. Thank you, Amar, for that wonderful presentation. Uh, I just would like to uh, add that we have uh, the next few presentations like this. I think you can see on the screen. We have finished the first three uh, sessions in this series. The fourth one is due on September 14th. So that's just a fortnight away. And uh, one more thing I'd like to show you is this is the lineup we have. One second, just give me a moment. This is the lineup that we have. So the first three we finished. The next one is going to be um, presented by.